There will be a lot of speculation today, so let's get it started. Windows 12. Many people are waiting for this version of Windows, although it's not a fact that it will be called that way. However, today we're going to discuss Windows 12. When will Windows 12 be released? The short answer is in 2024, so in fact it will be soon. By the way, that's three years after the debut of Windows 11. The difference between the release of Windows 10 and Windows 11 was six years. Yep, and this time it will be only 3 years, which is hilarious. Will Windows 12 be a free upgrade? Unfortunately, there is no reliable information about this yet, but with a high probability you will be able to upgrade from Windows 10 and Windows 11 to Windows 12 for free. I want to remind you, for this you need to have a Windows license. In connecting with the latest news, old Windows 7 and 8 keys will not be valid for activating Windows 10 and Windows 11, and of course Windows 12. Let's talk about system requirements. Rumors say that they will be similar to Windows 11. That is, you will need to have a processor of at least 8 generation if you have Intel or Ryzen 2000 series if you have AMD. Also, TPM will be a default requirement. However, there is one significant difference in requirements, and that is RAM. Microsoft might up the RAM from 4GB to 8GB with Windows 12. What will Windows 12 look like? Although Microsoft has not officially announced Windows 12, there is already an early prototype on the internet. And now I will show it to you, but in slightly better quality, thanks to guys from Reddit. Are you impressed? Because I'm not really. It looks like something modified between Windows 11 and Windows 8.1. The first thing I notice is the taskbar isn't attached to the edge of the screen. Instead, it's a little bit higher at the bottom of the screen. At first glance, not a significant change. If you look closely, you can see system icons in the upper right corner, such as Wi-Fi, battery, volume, and the current date. At the top center you may see a search bar and in the upper left corner we have info about the weather. That's it. Windows 12. Of course you need to understand that everything you just saw might change by the time of the release. Keep that in mind. I think that Windows 12 will have many AI features and programs. Also, the interface is somewhat similar to Android, because it could be optimized for the touchscreen as it once was in Windows 8.1. This is just my theory, so don't get me wrong. By the way, write in the comments whether you are waiting for Windows 12. And briefly about the latest news that everyone is discussing. Can Windows 12 require a subscription? The short answer is no. Microsoft won't be charging a subscription to use Windows 12 IoT. So friends, if this video was useful for you, please like it and I recommend watching this video on how to activate Copilot in Windows 11.